gonna try to get 3.4 gigahertz out of my Pentium 4 single core. I'm running at 3.8 right now. 3.38. It usually fails when I go anywhere over. I usually I ain't made it this far. Matter of fact. I gotta make sure the RAM doesn't overclock too. Let me go 162. My calculations are correct. This should be 4 gigahertz or 3.4. Um, gotta make sure the RAM doesn't overclock, like I said, so you can go different ratios. Um, I want to keep it right at 200 because it is regular DDR. So we'll have 10. Usually doesn't work doing it this way, so now I got to shut it off. Let's see. But the setting should be the same once we come back. If it loads now it usually crashes yeah we're at 3.40 I ain't never had it this high before if it runs it's crazy I'm trying to hurry up and get it to CPUs a eh? stinking quicker I ain't gonna try to run prime at this speed and then we got it 3.4 wow I don't know if you'll be able to see how I got it um, I got it all rigged up. Let me turn my light on here. A little brighter. It's got a little fan hanging over the heat sink. There's an all in wonder 128 megabyte ATI. 200 gig IDE Barracuda. <laughs> well, there we go. We're still running. 3.4, a little over actually. And here's the uh, that graphics all in Wonder Series. Just got a little four pin hanging off of it. Right here. There she is. Um, the memories. Hey, yeah, that's it's running within range. I think that's the trouble I had before because I was trying to overclock it too. But yep, yeah, there we go. Your single core 90 nan nanometer. Pentium 4 at 3.4 overclocked using nothing but the bus speed.